Hi, it's Miss Pritzel at the Upton West Library, and I am book talking Pieces of Me by Kate McLaughlin. So, this is a realistic fiction book uh, dealing with mental illness, and what probably the only book I can think of that deals with uh, what's called DID or Dissociative Identity Disorder, which most of us, you've heard of multiple personality disorder, it's the ter correct term is Dissociative Identity Disorder. Uh, I did learn a lot about that in this book, but I also found the story and the character very engaging. So um, our main character is Dylan, and the book starts out where Dylan ha wakes up and she doesn't know who she's with and where she is and why she's there. When she finally is able to get back in contact with her mother, she finds out that um, she's been gone for three days. Now, Dylan has had blackouts before, but she's always associated to the fact that she sometimes imbibes in uh, substances that might lead her to blackout. Um, so after this, nothing's ever happened for three days or this kind of length before. So she uh, gets checked out. Uh, she sees some mental health professionals, some doctors and mental health professionals, and she is identified as having dissociative identity disorder, as I said. Many of us, many people still say multiple personality disorder. Um, so Dylan has, Dylan is our character, but she, she has all, what are called alters, meaning the other personalities that are within her. Uh, one of the things we learn along with Dylan is that DID is usually caused by a childhood trauma that happens between the ages of five and seven. We don't, Dylan doesn't know, we don't know what that trauma is. Um, obviously, as part of the book, yes, we're going to find out what that trauma is. I did like that instead of focusing totally on the trauma, it's more about how Dylan and her alters deal with their discovery of what that trauma was. Uh, I thought this was a really good book for what Dylan was going through, but also what family and Dylan's family and friends go through as well when you have somebody who has this disorder. Like I said, I found this a really engaging book. Um, I learned a lot about DID. I liked the story. I liked the characters. And as I said, it's the only book I can honestly think of. Maybe there's other ones we have books on, you know, with OD, OCD and schizophrenia and uh, self-mutilation, you know, and depre depression. I can think of, you know, like, several books on each of those topics and, and other mental health issues, but this is, I can't honestly right off the top of my head think of another one that deals with DID. So if realistic fiction and uh, serious issues like DID are not your cup of tea, I will help you find something else. Have a fantastic day and keep on reading.